So this is it. Domestic football across the continent may all be done and dusted in the major leagues. But now we have the ultimate spectacle to conclude the season. The earliest phase in qualifying started way back at the beginning of last summer. And now there are just two teams standing. A show not just for the capacity crowd here, but one for the whole world. The global audience, they say, some 300 million. Truly, this really is a quite wonderful stadium located here at the foot of the Alps. So we're almost there, all one can see, a look of utter focus on the faces of all involved. You've been there, Jim Beglin. What will they be thinking as they wait for the whistle? Well, you're right, Peter, I have been in this position, and the message is usually something like, remember all the work, the hard work you've put in to get this far. So don't leave anything out there now. Do what you're good at. It's better than what they can offer. Stick to that, and you hope it'll be enough. So, just who will seize their moment? Look, we can only hope for a final that will be free-flowing and end-to-end -end and highly entertaining, but fear of defeat can often dominate the motions, so don't be surprised if it gets nervy and tense. It's the through ball, Benzema. This could fall anywhere! Pogba could move up a gear here. Throw in. Forward tracking back like that, always appreciated by the crowd. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team really, your striker should be the first line of that defence, and, and he's delivering. Alaba. It over to the other flank. Madrid have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So one Bissaka with the challenge, and he has given away a free kick. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? McTominay tries to get it forward quickly. Courtois sends that a long way. Modric. That's a brilliant interception. Bruno Fernandes. Well, the fact that we haven't had an attempt on goal is becoming a, an embarrassing reflection on these teams. Good take, and he's had a look. He's going for goal! Oh, good effort, he got plenty on that. And that's exactly the type of adventure we want to see in a final two, Peter, and it's a pity it didn't cause the net to bulge. Across the field it goes. Alaba. And it's played forward. Gets wrestled off the ball. Cristiano Ronaldo tries to stroke it through. Cleared without complication. Bruno Fernandes. And here's Pogba. Alaba. K. 
Casemiro. Tony Kroos tries to switch the play. Looking to break out here. Bruno Fernandes. Is there any support? He might not need it. Alaba just did a brilliant job there. It was one of those all or nothing commitments, and he came up trumps. Now it's Benzema. Benzema has been caught there, it's a foul. A spectacular effort! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Sit forward. The referee's awarded a free kick. Rafael Varan. And here's Pogba. Bruno Fernandes. It's a fabulous chance! And that wasn't far away. Cristiano Ronaldo almost put a side ahead with a, a pretty fierce attempt. He really spanked that. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Casemiro. Whistle's gone, and we've reached the halfway point of the final. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now. But still goals. So, Jim, the halfway point of the final, what are you thinking? Well, with it being a final, caginess is to be expected. Each obviously wants it badly, but neither wants to find themselves behind, and, and that's the issue now. An engrossing half, but this is where we started. Well, well. Just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Tight old game so far. Can that change now? Good challenge. He just stood firm. Oh, some tackle that. I have to say that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Great run on the overlap here. Beautifully done. Kroos gets in to thwart him. Kroos did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Receives it in a good position. And he's straight offside. Keeper's got good distance on that. Has a go! Oh, that is rather wayward. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Juan Bissaka. Now it's Cavani. Bruno Fernandes. Is that a foul? Yes, the uh, referee's given it. McTominay. And here's Cavani. The ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Now it's Pogba. He's had a look. He's been off try. Cristiano Ronaldo is an obvious threat from set pieces. He needs special attempts. Tries his luck. Oh, that was extravagant by any standard. Cristiano Ronaldo really improvised cleverly there. His quick thinking almost paid off in real style. Alaba goes looking. Decent looking ball. Bruno Fernand shot a goal! It's a goal! That could turn out to be a big, big goal. 
Manchester United are looking strong on the break. Winning the ball in midfield is one thing, but it's their clever use of counter-attacking. That's the real highlight. Big occasion, big goal, crucial lead. Well, Peter, the emphasis should now switch to winning it rather than even thinking about losing it. Cavani tries running with the ball at his feet. Looks to think on it. It's Pogba. Pogba, great challenge, time to perfection. Forward it goes. And here's Pogba. It's found its way through. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, denied brilliantly! Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Bruno Fernandes to take it, as usual. And he's there to clear it. Referee's given a throw. Bruno Fernandes. Maguire was not to be moved. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes drives it forward. Madrid are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they could still have a say. He's good for it! In it goes! And this is getting better and better. The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's, it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honour shift. Manchester United take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. And it's Cavani. And here's Pogba. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And he's fouled him there. Well, this certainly fits the bill when it comes to the man for the occasion. He'll fancy himself from here. Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, how's that for a goal? Sumptuous finish, an absolute Three. joy! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Dispatched expertly, nicely done. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. And helps available out wide. He's got away. Swept in. That will annoy the manager. They're making themselves too predictable here. And it's played forward. Now it's Hazard. And here's Benzema. Hazard. Now it's Hazard. Some are shouting for a corner, but the referee says goal kick. Sure. Tony Cross tries to dink it in. Play for a goal kick. Maguire goes looking. Cavani battles to win it back. Balls loose. Who's getting there? Yes. And that's it. Manchester United have done it. It is party time as they gather to get their hands on the trophy.
What a moment this is for all connected with the team. It's a day for pride, a day for glory. Another grand chapter to be added to their glittering history.